believe that anything is possible. Could we have another giant killing? Over to John McDonald. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, a very warm welcome back to the action. This is the fifth round of the Coral UK Open. That's brought to you by the Professional Darts Corporation, live on ITV Sport, where it's now time to meet our players. Ladies and gentlemen, Machine Gun, Jermaine Watamina, and the Flying Scotsman, Gary Anderson. Well, we heard from a victorious John Part earlier on about combining playing with commentating, so there could still be hope for someone in our commentary box this evening for years to come. John Rawling, do you fancy your chances? <laughs> Are you sure you've seen me throw a dart? I think not. I'll leave it to the guys who know what they are doing. And, uh, well, Chris maybe could get back. Me, never. Jermaine Watamina there. PDC Order of Merit, ranked number 39. He slowly moved himself up, and with what he's won here, he's uh, now moved up to number 38, and uh, he'll be rising in the rankings, I'm sure, and certainly will be if he goes and beats Gary Anderson here. But Gary Anderson will have had an eye on what's gone on in the previous match, and uh, a man who's not exactly on his Christmas card list, Gerwin Price, playing so well, and Gary, well, he's been scoring heavily, but his doubles haven't been quite up there. He's finishing not quite what he would have hoped for. But he's had some brilliant moments. Beat Robert Rickwood, 10-3. Reeling off seven on the spin. And then that quick-fire victory against Ricky Evans earlier on. The total match lasted just 18 minutes. And Gary raced into a 5-0 lead in, what was it, seven minutes and eight seconds or something like that? He can really hit big numbers and very quickly. And this game is going to be fast. It's going to be 95. slick. And it's going to, I think, suit Anderson's style of play. Spot on, John. He likes to play a player that 90s. just gets on with it, takes his darts out of the board and gets out of the way. 100. While you were on your route march across to the commentary box here, Jackie suggested that I might be able to combine commentating with playing. I said, I, I think not. There is the first of many 180s, I think, for Gary Anderson. Yeah, he's an inspiration, is John Part, <laughs> our fellow commentator. 139. Yeah. Commenta commentating, I admire, but I don't think there's going to be ever any similarity <laughs> in the manner of throwing darts. No, I've seen you play. 100. <laughs> Stick to golf. 67. That's not much better. <laughs> Watamina, no check out here, so Anderson on throw. Some pressure. 42 for Watamina if he gets a go. Oh, he oh. might do. 13. Boom. Well, that is a real aberration from Gary Anderson hitting that five. Double 18. Oh, and that's a missed opportunity. You've got to take those. Flashed at that one a bit, so tops. I remember he says to me, he hates double ten and Enjoy never hits it. I had words with him. He made me look like a bit of a wally during the, uh, one of our broadcasts. Well, not that that's a rarity, but... Oh, I hate double ten. Ever he... since you told me that, he's barely missed it. <laughs> I know. Every time he gets on double ten, it fair rockets in. I had words with him, Sam, he said, no, I never hit it. I said, Gary, I said, you've rarely missed it since you told me, and I told the world. Bit of reverse psychology, yeah. maybe. Tell himself he can't do something, and then he can. That was some match between Paul Hogan and Gerwin Price, John. It certainly was. And maximum number two. We're only in the second leg. Loves a 180. This will be a very fast, slick game. Checking where he is, 140, that'll do nicely, Trouble 18 for ball. Bullseye! No! See another bullseye here, or a bullseye attempt for a double 16. He went the 42 tops route, so ball. 
57. Close, Jermaine, closer Mar than the last 25. one. Nine double eight for Watamina. And he's into the match. Round. It's one apiece. On the throw. Game on. One hundred. Did have a brief chat with uh, with Gary. Actually, wasn't happy with his, his overall performance and his throw. He said my action doesn't quite feel right. I'm just, oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm not sure I'm with this now. I'd love yeah, to play this badly. Cracking game, wasn't it? That Gerwin yes. Price game really was. One hundred. Kerwin, if only he could produce that sort of throwing in the Premier League, he'd have uh, had a very different start to the one wow. that he's had. He's yeah, only... totally different environment, isn't it? Well, and that's it's true. De debut in the Premier League for him. It's de it takes some getting used to. 96. Now, 121 on throw for Gary Anderson. Six starts. Bullseye if he wants it. 81. 10 for tops, laying up. 20 for top, uh, 20 to One leave tops. The pressure on this 40. 40. Now then. In Three we go. The Gary nerve Anderson. holds. Gary Anderson Four averaging more than 105 and a half, as is Watamina. And it's 2 1 Anderson. 140. That back injury seems to be uh, not quite giving him the problems that it was doing a few weeks ago, does it? He's had a serious amount of 100. therapy on it, so whatever they've been doing is working. You can see he can get full extension now, in no pain whatsoever. 140. I was told he did three exhibitions last weekend after, yep. the, uh, after the Premier League. Sure 100. did. Says he's trying to 81. work as hard Jermaine as possible for as long as he can to secure the future of his children. 77, Gary Ricard, 140. Another title would certainly improve his bank balance big time. 100. Nice Jermaine setup. Ricard, now, what a meaner on throw. He's probably going to have to get this. Oh, he's oh, missed the 14. Well, that's the risk of going for the treble. Well, that is a mess. 33. Gary Ricard, 40. So Tops had it in the last leg but one. This Game time is in again. 3-1. Break a throw. Averaging 106.02. He is the bookie's favourite to win this tournament this weekend. 58. Rob Cross might have something to say about yeah, that. He's up next. Final game before we do the draw for the quarterfinals. Nervous? 140. No. I don't care. Well, there's some accusing looks if you get it wrong. <laughs> Good darts. One maximum eight. number three. Looking forward to seeing Ratajski and Rob Cross. I think that would be a, a very tight game. 100. He beat him in the UK Open, didn't he? Yeah, in the qualifiers. 85. He's, a, he's an underrated and under-talked-about player. player, Ratajski. I mean, we've seen him win in both codes, both yes. uh, uh, BDO and PDC. Well, and he, he, he's so solid. He always seems to be one of those who will come in with the 90, 95 averages. Well, we, we did the coverage uh, for the World Masters, and he, he was he was literally mid-90s from the very beginning. And he was one of the few players in recent years... Bullseye! ...to have won it from, from actual being non-seeded so he had to play a fair few games tops for anderson for 4-1 double 10 oh he's missed one mm. opportunity to break straight back and a break at the end of this and he has done precisely that that's an important one for jermaine watamina and gary anderson leads but it's now back on throw as they leave the stage with anderson leading 3-2 those first five legs, Chris, took seven minutes and 13 seconds. And my, my reckoning, that's five seconds longer than Gary Anderson's 5-0 lead that he raced into against Ricky Evans earlier on. And he's played better in this one. <laughs> I think there's more to do with the, the rate that Ricky throws at. Six legs, Jermaine to throw first. And rapid for a reason.
Averaging over 104, Gary Anderson. It's back on throw with Watamina with the darts now, who himself is not exactly throwing like a slouch. She's close to 101. Yeah, I'd be shocked if he could hold that 25. standard for the remainder of this match. We know Anderson can even go higher. We've seen him in the Premier oh, League a few weeks ago, averaging 110. Against Michael Van Gerwen. Yeah, albeit getting gubbed. 7-3. Great darts. Maximum number four. Watamina getting to this stage with a 6-0 win against Andy Hamilton. 10-8 against Stephen, uh, Steve Beaton. And then 10-8 again against Stephen Bunting. So he's not on an yeah, easy run. Great win against Bunting, wasn't 59. it? 59. Well, you suggested there'd be a few 180s in this one. Went wrong, John. Could be... Oh. One oh good ass. Brilliant. Great darts. 67. 167 for Anderson, can't do it, so Watamina's going to come back with a great chance to square up the match. Oh, look at that. Third uh, double out of seven attempts. 13 dart leg with throw. Doesn't give Anderson a lot of room to manoeuvre. If you're going to throw like that, you're going to have to have a nine darter to beat it. Spot on. Pricey missed one earlier, didn't he? Came close. Ian White's missed one. First 180 of the match for Watamina. That's five and counting. Fabulous and we're still only in the seventh leg. Yeah. Fabulous performance so far from Jermaine. We've seen glimpses of his talent over the last 12 months or so. Did I call him James again? I do apologise. This is his fourth UK Open. Got to the last 32 last year. And he's looking handily placed, with, particularly with that last treble, to maybe get a break of throw here. It's forcing Anderson to try and fill it up. Oh. No trying oh, about it. What a response, eh? Well, he can't do it now. Absolute class act. So easy on the eye, Anderson, when he's in this mood. Double seven. This is a big dart. Oh, and he's busted. Both on the wire. Yes. Well, that is a break of throw. Very assured on his doubles. What a meaner. Four from nine, 44%. Three from 11 so far. He slowly, worked, slowly worked his way up the rankings, hasn't he? He's been around yeah. since 2015, and he's slowly sort of clawing his way up. It's not too long if he carries on like this before he's into the top per 32. Only about 40 grand short in yeah. prize money, I think. See why. Into the eighth leg of this match. He's still averaging 106. Anderson averaging 105. And a breakdown. I was concerned about him sustaining an average of around 100. He's actually improving. Whoops. Butterfingers. Oh, what doesn't matter. No. Drop it, pick it up, slot it in. Look at that average now. And Gary Anderson responding. Goodness me, they're getting 180s for fun. Six for Anderson, double 12. What a leg of darts that is. An 11 darter for Jermaine Watamina. Last two legs completed, a total of 24 darts. Eight 180s already. Only played eight legs. This is brilliant. Great darts. Just, see, just saw one between Paul Hogan and it was 15 Gerwin in that Price. one, wasn't there? Yeah, and, they, and Stuart was describing it as the match of the weekend, which it may well have been, but this, if it carries on like this, is going to outrank it. Comfortably. 59. Anderson on throw, his favourite now. 226 required. Oh, not again, surely. Almost a leg, he had to win. A final in Dubai a couple of years ago where he played... Played uh, Michael Van Gerwen was equally, equally as ridi ridiculous as th this one for the 180s. Doesn't need to do nothing dramatic. 46. Just set it up. Tops when he comes back. Watamina's way, way back. So, tops for a hold of throw. And he's got six darts at it. Won't need it, I don't think. Two. Five four. Hold a throw for Gary.
break of uh, action at the end of this leg. You'd will it be 5 all or will it be 6-4? It's a big yeah, leg. Yeah, I'd love to nick this leg, Anderson. We'll be back where we started. 135. Credit to Watamina. Doesn't look overall to phased one bit. Whatever he's doing to his shoulder, to his back, it's uh, doing pretty well for Gary. There's Milton Keynes, he was having to wear a, a girdle of yes. sorts, wasn't he? A sort support. Of a, yeah. A support vest, I suppose, is the nicer way of putting it. Great, but yes. Great visit then from Watamina. Trouble 19, trouble 19, ball to leave 142. 97. Gary's Jimmy left himself the easier finish. Yeah. They'll only need one treble. Oh, look at this. Tops. Tops. They said as one. All right, treble 19. Could go double 18, double 18. 72 left. Yeah, he went for two double 18s. Fair enough. Seven. Biggest target Jimmy on the board. Mark Tops 40. for 6-4. Great marker. Oh, this time, surely. Oh, he's got the wrong side of the wire. What a let off for Gary Anderson if he can convert this. Tops, he's looked assured so far. And he looks assured once more. James Watamina, James, Jermaine Watamina can't believe that he got his pocket picked there. And Gary Anderson is back onto level terms. Watamina 5, Anderson 5. And what a match we've got here. It's Gary Anderson 5, Jermaine Watamina 5. Anderson averaging over 107. And Watamina snapping at his heels right alongside him. Shade under 104. Great match. Terrific. Those last. It's nice when we get it right. Those last five <laughs> legs took 6 minutes 29 seconds. A little bit quicker than the previous five. Incredible, isn't it? I mean, the standard is awesome. Eight 180s we've had. And Anderson just seems to be getting better and better right now. A real good place. 100. Whoever's doing the work on his back's doing a pretty good job. Give him a ring Gary myself. Six, Gary <laughs> 121. 121. Trouble 17. Oh, he's staying up, setting yeah. up. 90. Elected not to go for the bull out 80. on the 1 2 What's it mean? A 2 4 6, so yeah. no reason. Complicated game enough. Double 12, his favourite. Won his two world titles on double 12. And he's won that leg on double 12 as well. Knowledge, Chris. Hold of throw. Twice in a day I've shocked you, John. Well, you. you, you, you you do shock me on occasion, and that was that was good. <laughs> Not usually in the commentary box. <laughs> Brilliant from Anderson again. Seventh. Maximum's coming for fun. Nine in Nine the match. Six. Two for Watamina. Seven now for Gary. Not again, surely. Not again. Please make it eight. Oh, look what at this. It's on. It is on. Had so many chances already. So, 141, he'll start with the treble 20. Oh, he's missed it. Annoyed. And now it's just a question of making sure he wins the leg. Too good. Went for a 25 and hit the ball. Just got to make sure he wins the leg. We see it so often, players missing a nine darter and losing the leg. Double four, then. Good marker. Perfect. Seven. Jermaine well, Watamina can steal it. Jermaine steadies his nerves. No. That was a loose one. It was a jittery one. 78. Gary Important four. moment was to save the throw or give himself a chance. That's awkward. That's difficult. Not a big target there. Can't see a lot of it. Less now. King How Sean on earth did he manage to find a way through that? Answers on a postcard. What a phenomenal dart that great was. Great feel. Absolutely great feel. And the break of throw. Anderson 
7-5 in the race to 10. 115. Average has sunk down to less than 106 now. <laughs> 97. Shocking. <laughs> Jermaine Watamina. 101 plus. One oh. Maximum number nine. James Watanar, he's the snooker player, isn't That's he? That's where the James that comes from. the one. Fifty-seven. Well, a rare visit where he's missed a treble, but he's got time. One forty-nine, and what? What I mean, and not making him pay. Six starts from one four nine. He's going to need some of them. Not going to get out this time. Ninety-three. But it's not a bad setup, is it? Oh, he miscounted there. If he'd a bit trouble, trouble thirteen, he'd left thirty. Not that it matters. I think he could hit it off the lampshade. Tops. Oh, yeah, great dance. Superb Kyle dance Anderson. again from Anderson. 8-5. Continuing to hold that 106 average. 100. It's been the best consistent leg of darts, match of darts. One single performance that we've seen from any of the 96. players so far. We've seen flashes. Both of them contributing 59. to a wonderful match. As Watamina gone, the body language, he's not quite sparkling as he did a little bit earlier. Oh, if you don't buckle under this kind of pressure, then you're not normal. It's just a barrage, isn't it? It's just 59. relentless pressure. Phenomenal darts here from Gary Anderson. And that is a great start once more. Loose. More shock now, he does near 180 with a dart like that. Set up perfect. 146, what do you reckon? Odds, even money. Oh no, way more than that. <laughs> the way How strange. much do you want in the evens? I'll have a fiver. Oh, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> I'll still have that fiver. Get it. Oh. 130. Just call it a point, John. No finish for Watamina. So another break of throw possibility for Anderson and to go within one of a place in that last eight draw. Double eight, double four. Double two. Round the board 12, we go, and Watamina with a chance 36. to hold his throw after all. Oh, what a last start. Dry smile from Gary. I don't think he can quite believe that he managed to lose that one. No. Very frustrating. 96. Doesn't want to be losing his throw here, or Watamina would be back in the match. 100. How quick a game can turn around with the, the John Park of King match earlier. How happy was John Park when oh, we sat and chatted 99. to him afterwards? He was just, just absolutely inspirational. Himself, loving it. 140. Well, it's just about advantage Watamina here. Needed that treble. So he gets two. Yeah, needed them both, to be honest. Not on a finish. What a mean up. Well, he could have done 49. with 140. Six starts now, 172. Level 140. Just level a ton. 100. There we go. Going to be nicely placed to go 9 6. Oh, good last dart. Now you require 72. Oh, good dart. Double 12. Double 6. And yeah, that makes it 9 6 to Anderson. Anderson. The tournament favourite is within a leg now of victory. Watamina down at 98 average now. Anderson still over 105. And one leg away. 16. From a place in the last eight of a tournament, he openly admits it's not one of his favourites. 56. It's not often that uh, anybody plays in uh, the circumstances that we've had down here this weekend. No. Has been one which uh, we'll remember for a variety of reasons. Yeah, it's been bizarre. I don't think I've ever been as cold indoors as I was on, uh, on Friday. 58. Sitting commentating in sweaters. Is it even in thermals. your smoking jacket? I've got everything. It's almost a two-coat day. Peaky blinders. 131. 
He's on a finish, Anderson. Away to win it. 170. There's only one way to go. Can he do it? Oh, just dragged it south of that bottom wire. Has to be careful or finds a treble to leave 78. 94. So this is for victory, Chris. Treble 18, double 12. That's the treble. And that's Getting the double. Never in doubt, really, was it? A 14 darter to finish. James Watamina sportingly congratulates Anderson. A quite outstanding performance. He might have had reservations about his form before this match. He's going to be absolutely buzzing now. 105.19, the highest average of the weekend so far. And Gary Anderson is into the last eight. He beats Jermaine Watamina 10-6.